Hello everyone, thank you for tuning in. My name is David A. Kwa and welcome to my YouTube channel. If you're a brand new visitor to my YouTube channel and have no idea what my videos are all about, I love to talk about things I'm passionate about, man. Movies, comic books, video games, I do hauls, reviews, unboxings. If that's the type of thing you're into, you may want to check out my other content. If you like what you see, do subscribe. Today we're going to talk about another horror movie franchise. We're going to talk about The Ring today. In America, we have three ring movies and a short film. The short film can be found on the Ring 2 DVD, okay? It's based on a Japanese horror movie franchise, which started back in the 1990s. And man, the, the Japanese version, there's like several movies. There's like crossover movies with other film franchises, like The Grudge, like a Japanese version of The Grudge. And there's like, comic books and animes there's like a tv series and stuff like that it's, it's like a huge thing here in america we only have uh, these okay so uh, we're gonna talk about only the american version of this okay um the first two movies the main character is rachel in the new film the most one the one that came out recently a couple years ago the main character is julia there's one character that's common to all of them, and that is Samara, okay? I'll talk about Samara in a little bit. But, uh, yeah, first movie came out in 2002. Here's a DVD version. The best scary movie since The Sixth Sense. Hmm. Okay, Naomi Watts. If you want, you can pause that and read the uh, <clears throat> description of the movie and such, okay? The basic premise... Of this film franchise okay there's a video you watch and if you watch it you will be cursed in a week in seven days you will die unless you can figure out how to break the curse now how do you break the curse well you just gotta watch the movies yourself <laughs> here's a disc I like uh, way back when DVDs they put the uh, you know disc art and stuff like that okay here's the ring 2 there is the short film, which is a prequel. It's funny how they call it Rings. Now we have two Rings movies, okay? Um, there's a disc art. Some uh, advertisements here, okay? Some special features also include deleted scenes, uh, special effects, power, uh, featurettes, behind the scenes stuff, and others okay this is the unrated edition unfortunately it got a full screen i wish i had the widescreen version of this movie okay rings i just got this movie i bought it yesterday from big lot for like three dollars i just wa finished watching it this morning okay and uh yeah leonard's in it <laughs> from big bank theory okay uh, no special features on this there's some trailers and stuff for other movies but that's about it but this is when these days the DVD comes bare bones, man. If you want special features or something, find the Blu-ray. <clears throat> so let's talk about Samara, okay? She's the only character that shows up in all the movies, and uh, she's like the main like demon or ghost or whatever you want to call it in this in this movie. That's her, okay, Samara. Uh, in the original 2002 movie, so we learn about her uh, adoptive parents, Anna and Richard, okay? So Samara. She can have the ability to like burn horrible images into Anna's mind, her adoptive mother, and it drove her crazy. So Anna dropped Samara down a well, jumped off a cliff. Since Anna was gone, Samara had nowhere to go. Like she had no way to get release these horrible images, right? So she put on a VHS tape, which begins the curse. Okay. In uh, in the Ring Two that came out in two thousand five. We learn about Samara's birth mother, Evelyn. From the beginning, Evelyn thinks that uh, Samara may have demons inside her or something like that. So she tried to drown her, okay? That's how she got into the adoption agency in the first place, okay? In Rings, that came out in 2017, we learn about her father, her birth uh, father, who was apparently a priest who did unholy relationships with Evelyn, okay? So he had her locked up and was 
you know, doing all sorts of filthy and nasty things to her and stuff like that. And that's how Samara was born and stuff, okay? So, there's a lot of backstory. I'm sure the Japanese versions, there's like more backstory and such. But uh, that's pretty much the gist of it, okay? If you want to learn more, well, you just got to watch the movies yourselves, okay? They're, uh, they're really easy to get into. It's like a big mystery story, you know? I really enjoyed it. I did. I, I finished watching Rings last night. and uh, No, this morning, actually. I, I started last night, but I finished it this morning, okay? And uh, I actually really enjoyed it, okay? Julia, she wasn't so annoying and stuff like that. Um, uh, I don't know what to say. So I give the movie like a 8 out of 10. How about that? The entire franchise, 8 out of 10. You gotta check it out, okay? Now in Japan, they actually had crossovers with The Grudge, Sarah Michelle Gellar, that, that, that movie. Um, but not here in the U.S., we don't see much of a crossover there. But, uh, but yeah, check out this version, check out the Japanese version, and all the other, like, they have manga and a TV series. They had, like, eight movies or something like that. I, I, I don't remember, but, uh, but yeah, you gotta hunt them all down and stuff, okay? Well, anyway, that is it for this video. Thank you for watching, everyone. Be sure to comment and subscribe. And uh, we'll do another horror franchise next week. Okay, let me try to get a thumbnail here. Can you see the DVD collection? All right, talk to you guys later. Bye-bye.